today I'm definitely doing the laundry. I've been so lazy. Right, Mama? I've been so lazy. And you didn't help me neither. You didn't help me. You want me to put it back? But I need a wash today. Yeah? Look at your clothes. Her clothes is over there, guys. I'm about to put it on her. Come on. Guys, she walks a little bit more. Last time, Ricky was walking with her, but like holding her hand. And she was walking around. What? Right? Hi. Good morning, USA. What does that mean? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Look at Emily. What are you doing? I'm just recording because I need to watch. Is it for your channel? No. Hey, it's for it's for him and her. You have a channel now. It's for him and her. Hey, Be quiet. Look here. Anyways, um, okay, so I'm about to put. Did you put the bacon over there? I put the bacon over there. We're about okay. to eat some bacon. You want me to show? Yeah. We're about to eat some bacon with some fried eggs. Do we even have eggs, Sissy? Are you sure? Last time I checked, we, were, we had like six. Look, there's some bacon. Mmm, it's frozen, so I'll put it in hot water. And, oh yes, we have a lot of eggs. Oh, we got a lot of eggs, baby. We got like, babe, we got a lot of eggs. I told you we did, we have that big box. Yeah, we need to finish the small one though. I know. Sophie, get up. They're so lazy. Look at them. Let's see. Let's see them in their natural habitat. <laughs> get up. <laughs> she tried to get up like she was wide awake. She said, Hi. <laughs> get up already. Then get up already. Hmm? The pillow stuck to your head? No, not for real. It means like you're like you can't get up. Like you just want to stay laying down. <laughs> they were looking around. <laughs> they were looking for like it was really stuck to their head. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Look at Sophie. Come on, Sophie. Get up. I bought you a big chocolate bar. I'm just kidding. Dang, she woke up. You know what? I just remembered about your backpacks up here. And guys, this one's yours, right, Janice? Oh, this is Sophie's. Okay. Check inside your backpack and see if you have the library book. Because um, they already said that the schools here are gonna, like, online virtual school and everything is gonna end May 22nd. And they said that this week and till I guess the end of the school year, um, they have to start returning their library books. And I think Janacy had one. Sophie, they didn't send me anything. I think they say that you leave them in class, right? You don't bring your library books home? Yeah, she doesn't bring them home. Oh, there it is. That's the one that they sent me that they're missing. So we're gonna have to take this, I don't know when, but they said that they have some like drop-off boxes outside of the school. Oh no, but it's only during the week. So I guess we're gonna have to do that during the week. We have to go drop this off. Your old ring? I thought I lost it. Oh my gosh. We need to look through y'all's backpacks. Oh, there's like nothing in there. Library book. Oh, okay. Well, we need to return this book, and then they also said that um, they're gonna be sending home all their stuff. This is what I was worried about because I was like, I purchased a yearbook, and I was like, Where's my yearbook, and how am I gonna get that? Like, how are they supposed to give that to me? Like, I don't want to go up there and pick it up and everything because I don't want to expose myself or expose them to anything. And so, they said that they're gonna be doing this for everybody to get their last school supplies and. Um, anything else that they're, the teachers are wanting to send home, yearbooks, all that, they're gonna be doing that with brown paper bags and they're gonna do like a pickup, like whenever you're carpooling, like picking up your kids and all that. So the carpool line, they're gonna use it for parents to drive by and pick up their kids stuff, but they're not gonna get down. They're just gonna be handing you their bags. And that'll be like the last week of school, which will be around May 20 something that week. That week is the one where we're gonna pick up all their stuff and 
like that's it. It's so close? Yeah. Oh, it's an anniversary? I know. You know why? Because remember that we got, whenever we got married, y'all missed the last day of school? Because we went to Oklahoma? That's why whenever like the school year ends, it's usually my anniversary with Ricky. Because we got married. Well, our anniversary of like being married, but like being together, it's it's almost in June. It'll be 10 years. Yeah. 10 oh, years. I can say, um, what was it? What? Did you say that? Oh, <laughs> we, were, we were talking to her. And it's because every time that Ricky says something and I want him to like... Tell me the truth. I saw him pinky, pinky, like pinky promise. And then she's like, why do y'all always say pinky? What does that mean? And I was like, oh, it's like the same pinky promise. But we've always said that since we were younger. Um, since I was 14 and Ricky was 16 or 17, I don't remember. But um, we've always said that to make sure that we're saying the truth. And you can't lie when you say pinky promise. And then Denise was like, oh, I'm gonna start saying that too. And we were like, no, you can't be in the club until you have 10 years with us. And she was like, okay, well, next year. And she was like, I'm almost gonna be part of the club. <laughs> right? This is nasty. Just get a wipe or something and wipe it down. You get a wipe. I didn't even put it there. I'm putting my Why are you getting over. mad already? Because you don't clean it. Are you on your period or something? <laughs> I see you don't clean it. That's why I'm getting I'm mad. I'm cleaning it already. What are you talking about? Oh. What? That's, That's my... all you have to do is just wipe it down. Why me? Okay, well then don't I wipe it down. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Okay, then. I could have just done it. You don't have to be extra over here and get in my face. It's not that I'm being extra. It's just that you you know that it doesn't go there to see. Oh, I know that. I forgot. Okay, Whenever well, I'm putting my toothpaste away, sometimes I accidentally put the toothbrush in there. How? I didn't do it on purpose. How? Because this is where we used to have it. Okay. Well, now we have them over there. God, Why are you getting mad? Because you never clean it. I'm okay, but I just did. It. What are you and talking there was more about? There. You're not the only one that cleans it. Yes. No, you're not. Yes. <laughs> How am I complaining about something? On your something? hair, whenever you're cutting your hair, look, there's hairs all around there. What are you and I don't say nothing. Oh, you don't are clean you? it. Why are you being so I don't want to do this right now. I don't want to okay. do this right now. I'm just telling you, it doesn't. That's All I'm telling you is that it doesn't go there. It doesn't go there. Okay, it's okay, not there anymore. It goes there because I okay. hate it. I hate it when it turns white. Cause it's not even white anymore. It wasn't even that white. You don't clean it. You don't clean it. I'm the one that cleans it. You don't clean it most of the time. Okay. Okay, well, I Stop don't want to argue or none of that. I'm just telling you. It doesn't you are arguing because you're arguing over something so dumb. I'm then just, just tell me next time, don't do that. Next time, don't do that. <laughs> You're lying. Ricky. 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 Ricky! Just a good thing. I'm telling you, it goes there. Like, why would you put it here? You know, it stains it. I'm the one that cleans it. 
Bruh. You, you need to clean it. Because uh, I... How much do you need to clean it?